G'day everyone, Steve here, and today we're having a look at SHIB on the 14th of May. So the SHIBA token, now at the moment at the price of 0 0.00001212. Whatever that is in dollars and cents, I'm not quite sure, but that's where we're at. Today, SHIB is down 5.5% as the market is a mixture, some tokens up, some tokens down, but SHIB is down 5.5% today. And we'll take a measurement from the all-time high and SHIB down 86% from its all-time high of 0 0.000089. So SHIB has been in free fall, but in the last couple of days, it's bounced off this yellow support level here. This yellow support level was previously a resistance level. If we go back to September, August, July, this was a resistance level that Shiba would constantly bounce down from until it finally broke through on the 4th of October. Now, this historic resistance level now is acting as support. It's a very strong level for SHIB, and SHIB's taking support from it and, and bounced back in the last two days. Even though it's down 5% on today's trading, after yesterday's bounce back, it's still above this historical support. So, so SHIB down 86% from its all-time high, and that's typically the same percentage that Bitcoin would drop from its all-time high in the very, very bottom of a bear market. So with SHIB having dropped this far and now hitting this historical support line with lots of strength coming in at this support level, Let's see if SHIB can put on some kind of rebound and get some movement back to the upside. Why don't we jump over to CoinMarketCap and have a quick look at the SHIB story. So there's a story here on CoinMarketCap about SHIB being a very special dog. The dog was SHIB Inu and the dog inspired millions of people around the world to invest money in the tokens with the dog's image on it. Okay, so it's a meme token that was developed and in the early days was called the Dogecoin Killer. Shiba Inu was created anonymously in August 2022 under the pseudonym Ryoshi. Ryoshi says about himself that he is a nobody and not important and that the efforts to unmask his identity, even if successful, would be underwhelming. Well, could be a man, could be a woman, could be a genius, could be a fool, but obviously not a fool putting together Shiba Inu and building the SHIB army. More than a million people in the SHIB army at the moment. SHIB has many, many things going on at the moment. So SHIB owners are being encouraged to burn their tokens and receive rewards for doing so. So there's SHIB, there's Bone, there's Leash, there's She. There's a whole lot going on in the Shiba Inu network. So let's have a bit more of a look at Shiba Inu. Let's go to their Twitter. And the SHIB army is constantly doing things. They've got a massive army of support. They're constantly putting up posts and adding to the SHIB story. And when we go over to the SHIB official Twitter site, we see here at the moment, another one of the major projects they've got going on is the SHIB.io, the SHIB land sale. So if you want to buy your own dog patch, you can buy it from SHIB in the SHIB land sale, available right now. So you've got to say one thing for Shiba, they're constantly evolving, constantly innovating. So a token that started off as a meme is evolving into a lot more than that. So we'll go over here to the SHIB metaverse, and as you can see, you can buy your own piece of land in the SHIB metaverse. And they say here, we're building the immersive experiences that will allow users to explore, benefit, and interact with the Shiba Inu universe like no other. Our mission is to introduce a unique, fun and exciting way to have users earn passive income, gather in-game resources, generate rewards, and even allowing them to have a personal space in which they will be able to build and manage their own projects. Inu, so all the ins and outs of the Shiba Inu metaverse are still being developed, but if you want to get some land, you can get it now. So how many lands? are available. There's a total of 100,595 lands that will be unlocked over time. And at the moment, there's 32,124 available for purchase. 
And you can buy these lands with your MetaMask wallet using Ethereum. And if you've got any more questions, you've got to drop over to their Discord and have a look at what's happening over there. And if you'd like to buy some land in the Shiba Metaverse, you can go over to OpenSea. And here you go on OpenSea. You can see at the moment there's 19.2 thousand items listed, 5.4 thousand owners at the moment, floor price of 0.19 ETH, and 263 ETH have been traded. And here we are, some of the latest sales, $813 for a block, $2,800 for a block, $3,000 for a block, $386 for a block. So depending on the popularity of the block that you're after, you can buy a block of land in the SHIB metaverse from around $250 up to several thousands of dollars. So if you'd like to get into the SHIB metaverse, get over to OpenSea and get yourself a block of land. And we'll go back to the charts and have a look at SHIB on the weekly. And we can see fairly clearly here on the weekly, the SHIB dipped down the big dump, which everybody in cryptocurrency experienced this week, and the bounce from this support level, which was previously super strong resistance, which SHIB was not able to break through until the 4th of October. But now that super strong resistance level is a very strong support level. And Shiba and Shiba Inu at the moment has bounced off that support level and sitting, as we said, at 0 0.00001206 cents at the moment. So what will Shib so what will Shiba Inu do from here? They've got their NFTs, they've got their metaverse, they've got their land sales. They've got their Shiba swap. They've got their bone, their leash, their Shiba Inu token. Lots of innovation and things happening at Shiba Inu and a massive community of over a million people supporting the Shib army. So Shiba Inu, just a mean token or much, much more. Looks like we're going to find out very soon. So that's it from the charts. We'll just drop back over to the Shib metaverse. And if you want, you can go to their Discord, their Twitter, their Telegram, or check out the articles on Medium. Okay, well, that's it from me. My name's Steve, and we'll talk again soon. Bye for now.